Okay, so, boy, I always get this wrong. You know, I'll just do it like this. Here's the mess hall. There's Michelle, meow. Camp Whitley. There's lots of seating here. This will serve us pretty well. And then we got the kitchen in here. Big old stove, oven. You got like utensils and crap. Look at that mixer. Nice fridge, pantry area, freezer, fridge, another fridge. Oh boy. Anyway, and you know, dishes area here. Silverware, all this stuff, so we'll have access to all this. Okay, so, um, let me come outside here. There's like this, and then cabins over there. This red one here is the director's cabin. We do not have access to that. But everything else we do. In fact, oh my, we even have a dinner bell. Can't beat that. We're still kind of on a deck here. Some basketball courts. There's a boathouse down there. Alright, so I'm going to start filming again here in a minute. We'll go take a look at a cabin. At the average cabin. Okay, let's check out some of these cabins. There's actually five on this row here, and there's some over here. And there's more than it looks like. I think there's more than nine. I always thought there was like 20. Some of them look to be shut off at the moment. I am just dying to know if these still have scribbles on the wall from when I went here. Boy. Well, let's go check one out. Let's go to number three here. Here we, oh my god. Mmm. Oh boy, it still smells like camp at least. Turn on that light here. Alright. We got beds. There's even a dresser in this one. I wonder how old these actually are. Because some of these. Some of these, uh, oh yeah, like wall scribbling is like a tradition. <laughs> Looks like these must have been redone somewhat recently. I don't think there's any more scribbles from the 60s and the 80s here. But, then again, <sighs> Josh was here, so hard to say. Okay, so... Looks like we got stuff on the floor here. I don't know. Some of these are obviously like baby beds. <laughs> so I don't know. If you like it real snug, you might like it up there. Plenty of space though. Oh yeah. Okay. So. That's a tour of the average cabin. And we got a lot more to go. So I guess now we'll go check out the main lodge. Okay, here we are inside of the main cabin. I should just go to the door. Oh yeah, phone up, right? Here we have the projector screen. There's the projector up there. So, we can watch movies and whatnot. And let's see, there's a bumper pool. And a oh, the old foosball table's still here. Holy guacamole, look at all this. It's 
some old Camp Whitley pictures. Well, I'll bet dollars to donuts I'm at least one of these. Oh, here we go. Camp Whitley ribbons. This is something I wanted to bring up, but I wanted to get some pictures of them. If we wanted to do like an award ceremony, could be kind of cool. Bum -ba -dum -bum -bum. Let's see. And up here, let's see. Oh, all right, we're just gonna go up here. There's like, this was reserved for counselors only when I was a kid. But there's all kinds of like, there's a 64 up here, there's a PlayStation up here. I don't know where there's any lights. Bunch of couches for chilling out up here. This is gonna be nice. Way, way, way nice. Maybe it's possible. All right, I'm gonna make another video. I'm gonna see if I can turn on my light. Hey, there we go. There's one with some lights. <clears throat> see, we got like, this is a row of couches. It looks like, looks like people were partying here pretty recently. Maybe nobody comes up here anymore. Fuck, I don't know. Anyway. So, that's up here. But this is the upstairs of the main lodge. Let's see if you're looking down. I don't see the rest of it here. Into the bathroom we go. This is the ladies' bathroom. We got the actual toilets. That's nice. Some sinks with mirrors. It's getting dark back here. Shower, shower, shower. Nice. So we got three showers back here. Three sinks and mirrors. Three turlets. It's got to be lights in here somewhere. Bum, bum, bum. Why the hell can't I find them? It might be in there. Nope. Okay, so I don't know where the lights are for this, but there's a men's in women's room. And all this is just outside the main lodge here. Kind of by the cabins. Alright, so I'm gonna do I'm gonna get on my bike now and kind of do a rolling video. Alright, now I'm gonna do my best to film and not fall off. Great, that brown building there is the uh, the art lodge. I gotta ask about that yet. A couple of cabins out here. I don't know why. I don't know if they're any good. I'll ask. We're heading to the point right now. Just trying to be careful. It's a little bit muddy. Hold on, folks. Easy now. Would you look at this? There's cabins out at the point. These are old ones. Here's where you have the bonfire. These are the old cabins. 
Oh, I for sure will find my name written on one of these. I have no idea if these are habitable. Habitable? Habitable? Well, you know what? what? Might as well just go have a look. Can't hurt to look. Unless they're full of like bees and oh yeah these are the old cabins oh my god yep oh yeah these are the old cabins they are empty but it sure does look like somebody could throw their sleeping bags in here maybe a little broom out maybe we'll have a day before where we come out and clean some of these up these are totally going to be okay Which one is this? Is this seven or seven? Ah. All right. No family of raccoons or possums, please. Uh, I can't move that without a hammer or some kind. Oops, spider. All right. Well, in a pinch, I'm pretty sure people that want to. Camp Primitive and right by the bonfire can stay in these. Well, it looks like we have more housing than we thought. I don't know what kind of shape these are in, but <laughs> I think they'll be all right. This is the big bonfire pit. This is the point. Somebody had mentioned something about coming out here and getting feral and growing tusks. This is where you do it. All right, let's go back toward the camp. Gotta take it easy, it's pretty sketchy with one hand on a moped in the dirt and mud out here. Coming up on that mud again. Gotta give me just a second. Some of the old cabins from way back in the day have just kind of been moved out here. So, looks like there's more if people want to attempt it. They're not as nice, but they're here. There's the 
sitting logs from you see from the map. cut this video short here so it doesn't get too long I'm just gonna start a new one we're back I said that by the time we get here, the docks might be gone, but I don't know. I think there's like a floaty, bouncy thing out there. And then there's this thing, there's kayaks and some canoes. I think we have access to all those, as long as the dock is still in. Here's the boathouse. Changing area. That really looks a lot nicer than it used to. <laughs> uh, like I said, some canoes. Stuff for us to have some fun on. Canoes and kayaks. Preservers. All the paddles for the kayaks and canoes. What is that? Oh. That's the mess hall. Kevin's. So, that ought to just about do it, I would think. So, yeah, I'm going to post these up here. When I got home, we got some Wi-Fi. All right, see ya. As this is the other uh, Tinkham's cabin, it's kind of down the road a little ways. Well, I mean, it's, you know, in the driveway of the camp, but it's just down a little bit, maybe a quarter mile. That'll fit a whole bunch of people. Maybe a whole bunch of people. And then there's a trail back there that goes to the haunted Tinkham's cabin, but <clears throat> I got a couple pics from in there. It was really fucking dark. I couldn't find a switch. It's nothing but a bunch of bunk beds. But um, it's huge. It'll fit a lot of people.